clean. It's like a satin figure. Like you don't even see it. It's hard to even see in the picture, right? This guy deserves a lot more. So one cool thing about him is he uses the Motown tuners, but makes his own buttons. Like those are people. Got the word beats. Oh my goodness. Wow, it's like infinite sustain on this. All right. This is a beautiful tenor from Ken Franklin out in uh, California. And this one features a beautiful Engelman spruce top. Quilted maple back inside <laughs> thing is gorgeous it, it pops a lot even with a satin finish um grenadillo binding you got this beautiful side port same material for the bridge fretboard and the rosette in between you got the this really nice work um it's the same wood grenadillo with maple in between and that same pattern same kind of design continues on with these offset fret dots here what what an artist holy moly uh, radius fretboard these have the worth brown tenor strings on it with the oasis wound low g holy crap this thing is a featherweight too Maple neck, too. Speaking of neck, this is a very comfortable neck. This is a neck for everybody. Wow. Up on the faceplate, you got the same quilted maple and this nice grenadier strip on top. That also continues on the side here and it kind of blends in with the uh, well, like face plate and whatnot. Uh, Goto tuners, but Ken custom makes these buttons for them and is also done in maple. So, yeah. From Ken Franklin, this beautiful masterpiece. Holy moly. Mm -hmm. 